the International Peace Institute's MENA office based in Bahrain hosted an Art for Peace exhibition, showcasing artists from across the region. More with Yasmin Ibrahim in this report. I would like the International Peace Institute for the Middle East and North Africa hosted an Art for Peace exhibition in collaboration with Ms. Wadad al-Bakr, along with the participation of painters from the region who aim to promote peace through their artwork. I took the initiative of uh, establishing this uh, beautiful, peaceful event. I, I called my uh, colleagues, the artists, and I asked them to have this donation uh, uh, to the International Peace Institute and uh, I was really honored that they accepted. Uh, I believe that art uh, brings people together and uh, despite this, uh, I mean, uh, their differences or their backgrounds, uh, art has no language, uh, no religion. Uh, uh, it, it comes from the heart and goes back to the heart. I'm so happy that a group of women and led by a Saudi painter, Widad al bakr generated this momentum by mobilizing a number of uh, painters and majority of them are women from Bahrain to come and offer and donate their paintings as a token of recognition to the efforts of International Peace Institute Middle East and North Africa to work on making peace prevail in the region. The exhibition showcased art pieces by prominent painters of both women and men whose work was inspired by the pressing need to encourage activating peace within the region. Through painting, it is, will be uh, a good message uh, for a peace. And here, as example of uh, my work, and we hang it in the uh, Institute of uh, Peace uh, in Bahrain. And I'm sure uh, the painting will be uh, for global and for any visitors of the place who will get uh, calm, peace, uh, happy. The event aims at fostering the culture of peace through inspiration and creativity, where the artworks will remain at the custody of the IPI Amina as tokens of the artist's attachment to peace in the region and beyond. The Art for Peace exhibition showcased more than just peace in the artworks showcased here today. Reporting for Bahrain International, I'm